We got the CIA, ancient burial grounds, high-tech hotels, and a whole lot more. Animation is getting dope. Nerd soul. Late ill kid at one youngster holding it down, bring you that street geek and nerd soul. What is up, my people, today? Oh uh, yeah, we about to get into another wonderful episode of Thumbnails. And today, man, we've got a jam-packed list set up, so let's not waste any time. Let's do this. Hot Lana Wax is a brand new animated series being brought to you on streaming, but not by Amazon, not by Netflix, not by YouTube, not by Hulu, but from Vimeo in their partnership with none other than Outkast Big Boy. Now, right now, details are scarce and they're coming in from a Rolling Stones interview, but it's promised to be one of the most out of the box animations that you've seen because this is going to be about a retired CIA agent that buys a car wash that is also plotted on a land that used to be an ancient burial ground. There's going to be like aliens, zombie strippers and all kinds of crazy mess. And that's just in the couple sentences that they gave us. So, you know, this show has a lot to cover. But the cool thing is, an uh, added extra piece is that the music for the show is going to be composed by none other than the world-renowned Organized Noise. And you know how they get down. Now, Big Boy did say it was going to be triple X, but not triple X as in adult kind of content. Triple X as in being straight, raw, and crazy. And since he's voicing one of the characters, I am straight up for this. I am extremely excited to see where this goes because this is a wild premise. So it's one of those things where it's like, you know what? Show me something. Let me see what you got. And plus, seeing something like this on Vimeo being a, a, a semi-newer delivery service for a project like this, I'm interested to see how this plays out. Are you interested in this? Are you hyped to see Big Boy getting into animation? You know, Dre did animation with Class of 3000, which is classic. And now you have something like this with the music from Organized Noise. How can you resist? I mean, seriously, Organized Noise? Just, yo, it's freshness. Matter of fact, if you don't know about Organized Noise, they have a documentary on Netflix, which you should check out. But of course, that is all we have right now. But as I learn more, I'm going to holla at you. So holla at me. I'm going to holla at you. Let me know in these comments what you think about a new animated series about a retired CIA agent that has a car wash on an ancient burial ground. Who knows how this is going to turn out. But anyway, we're going to go and move on because this joint ain't the only thing we got going on. So uh, next up is a trailer for the new animated series coming out for Nickelodeon called Welcome to the Wayne. And it's about this crazy hotel where a whole bunch of top secret, you know, like, you know, special documents and special agents are there. And you have Ali, <laughs> Ali Timbers kind of followed by his friends in figuring out these different mysteries, these different plans, these different plots by people that may or may not mean to do them harm. And this this kind of is endearing because it's so whimsical. I mean, look at the animation. We're Team Timbers. We protect people. It works. With stuff like that, especially with kids, even with adults like myself, you can't really lose. It just looks, it just looks fun. It looks like a fun time just enjoying their small adventures because they've got to protect this hotel from God knows what. But before I move on, let me remind you guys that you can find me at Black Hollywood Live. That's right, the first online network for African Americans. They got celebrity interviews, after shows, sports talk, geek nerd tech, all that. You can find them online at blackhollywoodlive.com. And once you check that out, you can keep up with their blogs or their posts from week to week, and then check out their videos on youtube.com slash blackhollywoodlive. So with this looking like a lot of fun, with the Wayne Hotel looking like it's full of, you know, crazy mysteries for kids to get into, and a whole bunch of safe action, if you will, how are you feeling about it? Like, after seeing this trailer, 
Are you digging it? Are you into it? Are you going to watch it? Are you going to have your kids watch it? What do you think? I think I, I think I could get into some a situation with this where I'm like passively watching. Like I might not, you know, be setting my DVR or racing home to see it, but this is something that I think you could really enjoy. It kind of, you know, like kind of burn up like three or four episodes at a time and just like giggle your little butt off on what these kids are doing, you know, parachuting and and you know, doing action roles and having their little action scenes inside of this fun hotel. So, um, of course, jump down in the comments, holler at me, I'm gonna holler at you, about what you think about Welcome to the Wayne. But we got one more thing going and we got to get to it. So, um, yo, uh, next up is a fan trailer for X-Men Dark Phoenix. Now, recently it's been announced that the next film from Fox for X-Men will be including or kind of surrounding the Dark Phoenix. And they've also casted Lalandra already. So a fan has put together small clips of the Phoenix Saga from the 90s X-Men cartoon to kind of give us a vibe of what this movie could look like. Now, of course, the X-Men Fox films have never super followed the comic books or the animated series for that matter. And I'm not sure how close it'll be to the animated series clips that we saw. But one thing that I love about this trailer is that it really takes you back to the fun moments with Jean, Professor X when he had to send them into space, you know, Storm standing by his side, you know, Cyclops there when the Phoenix Force, I mean, when the Phoenix first entered her body, all of this stuff, it just, it kind of brings you back. And it's nice to see those shots. Now, I've never, I'm not a super fan of what Fox has done with the X-Men, barring a couple of films. But I do have a little bit of hope with what they're doing further down the line. I think that they've seen the criticism from the Apocalypse film, but have taken it and used it to build instead of to kind of like just cast away. So I'm excited for what they've got coming. You know, I'll reserve everything until I see a trailer, especially since they're talking about Jessica Chastain. This could be a real big move. So of course guys, holla at me, holla at you. I know this was a fun take, so check out that trailer. Let me know what you thought about the trailer. It was so great to just be taken back to that time for a little bit and just enjoy the animated series that I used to enjoy all the time during the week on Saturday mornings, whatever. So, of course, before I bounce, I got to tell you guys to hit up thatnerdsoul.com. That's right. You can check me out. All the videos are right there from the oldest, the latest, the newest. All that right there for you and your perfect consumption on demand, of course. Then hit up shop.thatnerdsoul.com and pick yourself up a t-shirt player. And don't forget one, huh, a for the playettes. Then... Come back here, like, comment, subscribe, and share that nerd soul. That's right. There's no better way that I can show people that you like what you are watching. And my shout outs got to go to LA What Up, VA What Up, RVA, you got my heart. And please, yo, man, be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. And on the real, take that X-Men 90s cartoon for a spin again. Think you'll have a good time. Peace.